hello guys hello everyone welcome back to my channel good morning good afternoon good evening yes my wonderful viewers my people hmm. i have yet another interesting video for every one of you that is coming from the ex-wife of late alafi of oyo the person of queen ola who was alleged to be having an affair with squam one and now mc Luomo. She has come at all, hmm, my people not be smoking. She don't talk a lot of things full ground. She can't still let us know what see a laugh here for your do uh, before a laugh here for your buy. Hey, hey. When I talk and say they don't tell small picky, make it not grow big teeth. But make it make sure say the lip when he carry for front, he go fit cover the teeth. On a fissy at the light. Hey, hey, hey. This our queen Ola or S queen Ola no be smoking I, I don't see. When we talk and say those of them when they could carry they enter the palace say that they go marry a laugh here for you that they go marry a laugh here for you we love him genuinely we love him truly una fi say a laugh here for you no get sense e o a laugh here for you oba a day ye ye una fi say e no get sense abi a laugh here for you no say most of una when they come marry am una come because of money because of fame because una one day popular so i love for you for your open mind open your eyes say any of you now when you go come up for the palace you go show una shake and that is what i love for you for your deed to this our s queen ola make una calm down i go let una know everything in a minute meanwhile if you are meeting me for the first time you are highly welcome subscribe and turn on the notification bell for here we they talk about yoruba celebrity royalty everything from yoruba land now here with the drop palm so if now wait till you like wait till they intrude they interested for subscribe and turn on the notification bell thank you to our returning subscribers she she go we thank you now we appreciate you now all right so my people so the news when they go viral una they see for that is a alafi Put restriction on late monarch's wife. Ola respond to her alleged affair with MC Oluomo and Kwam Wan. So this gist can be like say he carry many many branches. Because we go talk about the restriction when Ola fear for your put for inside S Queen Ola life. And the relationship when it comes to Kwam Wan and MC Oluomo, yes, so my people. So if you remember, you remember, say this our baby, I won't call her baby, our sweet potato. She come out for Allah for for your palace 2020. A lot of rumors, people talk, go left, right, center, my people. We not know say when she come out for palace, her international passport. Allah for for your put restriction for the passport so that she no go fit travel out of Nigeria. she not even know anyways make we read what they the carry give us for year and then we go come see what she use our own max they talk for inside this matter my people make una not go anywhere carry your coke and popcorn make you sit down so that they will go digest the gist for you the way the matter today according to the news they can read and say queen ola badirat the youngest wife of the late Alafi of Oyo, Oba Lamidi Adeyeye, has finally addressed the viral report of having an alleged romantic relationship with all Progressive Congress APC Shift 10, MC Oluomo and Fuji singer King Wasil Ayinde Marshall, aka Kwamwan. Hmm. The rumor broke out when gossip blog, Gis Lover alleged that the late Alafi's wife, Queen Ola, including other female Hollywood stars, is secretly dating MC Oluomo, adding that she was arrested and detained by the Department of State Service in December. Now, clearing the air on the allegation, Queen Ola revealed that her arrest by DSS is not a secret, stating she had also told some people about the incident. Narrating what transpired, the queen said she was pardon me, she was unaware that the late monarch had put a restriction hmm, on her international passport before his demise, which led to her arrest while traveling to Uram and was detained in DSS custody for two days, my people. Hmm. 
The queen noted that she reached out to a few people but they couldn't do anything. But MC Oluomo helped and she would forever be indebted to him. <laughs> she also debunked the claim that she was in a relationship with Kwam Wong before leaving the palace in 2020. In her West, my people, before we read what she talk come at, Una no say that 2020. People carry a court talk and say, this our queen. Say, what he make her come up for the palace and because of our Egbo, Kwam Wong. Say, because she did relationship with Kwam Wong. Now, she don't come out. She don't talk and say, this is not a secret because I personally told people about it. Long story short, my baby daddy put restrictions on my international passport before he died and I did not know. I was traveling for Uram last year in December and I was detained by DSS for two days. The inst instruction he gave them was to detain me and transferred me to Abuja that I ran away with the kids, my own kids. Oh. My phones and everything were seized and it was only my sister who knows where I was because we are both on board. She called everybody she could to help but they couldn't do anything except Oluomo who came to my aid because my mom cried to Igwe and I was set free. So what do you all want me to do? Turn him to my enemy because you all don't like him? If that is what you all do, I won't do that. I will forever be indebted to him. I did not see anyone and me. I did not see anyone and me not coming here to call anybody out doesn't mean I should accept anything thrown at me. I couldn't eat or bat for two days. It was the morning of the third day I was set free. Just because I did not come here to say everything that happened. To me, after I left the palace, like others, doesn't mean you all should judge me. This same man freeze my account when I left that. Me and the kids could not feed on our own until I begged people for money. Hey, show na de ye, una de ye, say a laugh for your even freeze our account. I was locked up in the palace for weeks before I escaped through jumping the fence. They lied I was dating Kwam Wong. I kept quiet a lot of lies. I have told a lot of pains and me being an introvert doesn't mean I should let everything slide. So this one I wait till she come out, come talk or come let us know. Say she ain't know they talk, no mean say she eh. Uh, she don't know what she be do. She be the quiet type, but she no go take everything when it be say they lie for her head. Anyways, my people, now so the matter be, now so the story be make una let me know what you na think for the comment section. This matter be like say go long because this one I just two days ago na they publish and na they see on twenty second of March twenty twenty three. I go see una for my next update. Make una take care and bye bye.